So level one of the four pole, you can use a pair of yoga blocks or something where you can put your hands on, maybe like a stool. Yeah? So you're going to bend down here and then try to touch the blocks with your palm. And then from here, you're going to try to straighten your legs. Slowly pulse. Okay? If you can't straighten your legs, then just slowly pulse and just feel the stretch. And then as you get better, you should be able to do more. Now you can also try to stretch one leg at a time. So I'm going to left, then right. So this is slightly easier than doing two legs at the same time. So do this enough times. After a while, when you get warmed up, when you get more flexible, you should be able to do it with both legs. Okay? And then when you're comfortable here, just try to stay here for at least 6 to 10 seconds and feel the stretch. And then as you get better, you can proceed to level 2. So level 2 is the same thing. The only difference is we don't use yoga blocks. We put our hands on the floor over here. So imagine there are no yoga blocks here. We bend down again. Notice I'm bending my knees and I put my hands on the floor. Over here I can reach. Then from here, again the same thing, I try to straighten my legs. Straighten. If I can't, I just do pulses. Or I do left, right, left, right. And once you can do this, then you just hold it there for the time being. This six to seven, ten seconds. Okay? That's level two. Now, if you want to have even more flexibility, you can go for level three, whereby you're going to use the yoga blocks again. You're going to stand on top of the yoga blocks and you're going to do exactly the same thing as what we did just now. You're going to bend down, bend your knees and then put your hands on the floor. And then we're going to try to straighten our legs again. But this time we're trying to keep our stomach towards the thighs and then just straighten. Again, same thing, you can straighten all these two pulses, whatever way you can. And or you can do left, right, left, right, and then straighten and then hold here. And then if you want even more flexibility, you can put your feet on another set of yoga blocks to make it even higher. Once you have this level of flexibility, it should be quite easy for you to just go down, grab your legs behind, and then just touch here. And then come up here.